was a day of excitement for Funky Tours as they launched their newest vessel, Millennium One. Five years ago, Funky Tours had the vision to add another vessel to their fleet of reef boats. And on Thursday, as the vessel set sail, owner Michael Frank and his family beamed with joy as it was realized. Frankie said it's all about Tobago. Tourism is about development. Tobago needs development. It doesn't have to be boats, but generally. Um, in order to have a better tourism product, we have to have a better tourism service. So adding a new boat would only make sense because it, it adds to that value of Tobago. Frankie shared his love for the tourism industry sprang from his employment as a reef patrol officer when he was 17 years old and was asked to tour a visitor. I took him just on a friendly trip around the island, but he was so impressed with the knowledge I, I passed on that he started sending more people to me. He sent a whole big group two weeks afterward. They were all travel agency. And from there, I never stopped. It just went on constantly. Um, and I moved from just one car to a whole fleet of rental cars, into buses, into boats. Free Wi-Fi, two bars, and much more foot space as you enjoy the beauties of the Book Reef and the Millennium One, which was constructed in just over two years. Every time there is a high peak, we have the issue where the boats are overcrowded. And because of that, there is a niche that lets us know that we have to have something to fill the space. We don't want to have the problems where there's too much people on the boat and people is not comfortable. So in order to fill that gap, we decided we're going to buy a vessel that can accommodate a lot more passengers. Frankie took it up a notch, ensuring all staff members are professionally uniformed. They know when you see somebody working for Frankie Tours, they have an ID and they have a uniform, so they could differentiate themselves. With the usual Ash Wednesday activities set to take place in Tobago, Frankie says it will be a busy period for them as well. We have a lot of bookings already in place and we're expecting to have more. We're going to have trips all day long from 9 in the morning, 11, 2 o'clock, 5 o'clock. We have some trips as late as up to 9 o'clock in the night. People just want to go and look at Bioluna Sense and that's this type of thing. You know, and of course, there's people who come in to celebrate the after carnival. After more than three decades in the business, Frankie noted he's leaving a legacy for his children and the family. He also gave us a sneak peek into what is next. Submarine. <laughs> We're looking for a submarine. Eh? We have to bring more things to the table. And um, a submarine is something that is very important to Tobago. We have a lot of big deep reef that we used to start checking about. Um, so yeah, I'm looking in terms of that. I, I want to get up there and do something that is different. Frankie Toe says in the meantime, they continue to focus on providing the best service on the ocean and this they did on Thursday as attendees of their launch received a cruise on board the Millennium One. What an experience. Yes, Funky Tours and his team believe this new vessel will provide a special boost to Tobago's tourism industry. I am Carissa Douglas for TTT News and I love Tobago.